My name is Dasi, but I go by Anoki in my art practice, and my language groups are Yoda Yoda, Jajawurang, and the name of my piece is My Aunty Once Told Me. From the earliest memories I've had of being a child, to being a teenager, to even being an adult, we would have our aunty come over, and she'd be like, oh, can you make me a cup of bath? And it was that tradition of, you don't know when, but they'll definitely be there, and you'll probably see them tomorrow. And the only thing that stays consistent is that you'll make them a cup of tea. And that's just like been a tradition ever since I was a child. The saying, no matter how much milk you put in tea, it's still tea, comes from the element of tea itself. The most important thing is the water in the tea bag, of course. You can have your tea black. But then, of course, you can add milk to that. And depending on how you like your tea, it's going to change. And I think that's like the same when us mob are born, it doesn't matter what skin colour the parents are, you might come out darker, lighter, but at the end of the day you're still mob and as long as you have that connection to culture, you are still black. Unapologetically black to me means unapologetically black despite skin colour and not only skin colour, also a celebration of queerness and black queerness and black love and black gender identity. The reason why I incorporated the LGBT plus flag within the piece was because not only did I want it to be a celebration of who you are despite skin colour, I wanted it to be a celebration of our mob who have it hard because not only they may be born however they are with their skin colour, but also when you are born queer, it's you are now the minority of the minority within your own country. I wanted to make an art piece for this tram that people could look at that and be like, oh, I can see myself represented because there's mob of all skin shades, all shapes and colors, and all sexualities and genders on here.